Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. In this week's video, I'm going to be talking to you about levels and how we go about using them on site. I'm a ground worker based in the UK and have been involved in construction my entire life. So, to ensure a building or a housing estate or a skyscraper is built accurately and level, we use instruments like a laser level. Now, I'm going to explain how we go about using them. So, in the UK, down south in Cornwall, there is a national reference point called the Ordnance Datum Newlam. We transfer it across the country so we're all using the same point to build our buildings. So we know that an architect or an engineer in an office is going to be quoting the same level as what we're going to be using on site. So what is a datum? A datum is essentially a level from which all heights in the UK are measured. An engineer will transfer this national datum level to a point on your building site, which you can use to build your house, driveway, drainage, anything you need it for. How do they transfer this level from normal all the way to your building site, say in the middle, in the Midlands, in Birmingham? They see something called a total station or other GPS tools. So this tool will enable them to be able to transfer that level from all the way down south to where you're building. These bits of equipment are quite expensive. So once the engineers transfer the national reference point to your building site, we can take it from there. We normally use a rotary laser level to transfer the point from the data on site, which our engineer has set out, to the area where we're working. How do we go about doing it? First of all, you want to get yourself a rotary laser level. Set it up on a tripod so it's nice and sturdy, not going to blow over the wind. Once you've done that, you'll need a staff. The staff is effectively a measuring stick. You'll see loads of different little blocks on these staff. Each one of these represents 10 millimeters. Or you can see where the numbers are and the lines, they'll represent 100 millimeters. Now we use the staff to get the level from the datum point to our work area. So how do we go about doing it? Once the laser head is set up, we'll walk over to our datum point and we'll rest the staff on top of the datum. This will give us a measurement. This measurement to how high our laser head is above the datum. Okay, so let's say the datum height is 50. 50.000. What this means is this is 50 meters above the national reference datum down south. Now, whatever the measurement of the staff is, is then added to the datum which has been transferred to height. So from the transfer datum to the laser head, it's 0.9 meters. Therefore, the laser head we know is 50.900 above the national reference point down in Cornwall, the ordnance datum newell. So using drawings which have been provided by an engineer or an architect, we know the level we need to set our foundations, our drainage, our driveways, anything we need to build, we know our levels. So using the drawing, we can see here the level we need. We've figured out that our laser head is set to this height and this is the height of the level we need. Now, if you deduct the level required from the height which our laser head is set out, this minus this, it will give us a measurement. This measurement, we need to adjust our staff to. So here you can see we've adjusted our staff for this measurement. And there we have it. There is our finished height. Simple as that. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more, click here to see my latest video. Bye-bye.